When you enter a cenote, it's really like going into a, another world, like leaving, leaving the planet behind. This is a feeling of really exploring something new. And I feel very lucky to be able to see that. My name is uh, Julian Bode. I've been freediving and scuba diving for the last 15 years in many uh, different locations, always trying to find the best uh, diving spot. Those cenotes are, are caves. All those cenotes are connected to each other. And the, the water goes and flows from one cenote to another cenote to end up in the sea. The first time you, you go into a cenote, it's something you don't see anywhere else. It's a completely uh, different experience than diving in the ocean. At the beginning, it can be a little bit scary, but really quickly, uh, the beauty of the place would just take over. Some cenotes are very welcoming, sometimes so big and so clear that uh, it really gives you the sensation you go into a church and you don't want to talk too loud to not disturb anyone. And some of the cenotes are also have a little bit like an atmosphere, more like hell with uh, uh, dead trees in the bottom and, and sulfur. The Mayans were uh, using the cenotes for a very long time. Basically, the land where we are, that's the place where the living people live. And then underneath the cenotes, into the ground, was the place for the dead. Every cenote uh, has a different personality, but I also think that it really affects your own personality. At some point, you kind of enter into like a meditation state that, for me, is completely priceless. Thank you.